This morning in the road home, we are speaking with Jennifer Foster of Adoption Rhode Island and Nairobi. Ron and Pete Cardi of Cardi's Furniture and Mattresses, all about that home theater and football season. We love this time of year. Good morning, everyone. Morning. morning. How are you? Great to chat with you, Ron. We're going to jump right in because as I mentioned, it is football season. People love to get a nice comfy spot as they're watching their games. That's right. We're going to take tailgating inside. We'll do our tailgating in the living room. And whether you want home theater, regardless of the type of seating, we've got it. So if you want a straight sofa, if you want a reclining sofa, if you want a recliner, you want uh, to articulate the head with the head adjustment or the back, the lumbar or the, the feet, we'll get you in the most comfortable position so that you can see the game from any angle that you want. Yeah, and you have some great ways to, to view the game. I and mean, you got home theaters. You're, we're really going to make the entire room uh, a spot that we want to hang out in. Absolutely. You know, and whether you're going, like I said, with a straight sofa, reclining, or you get into a sectional, mm -hmm. uh, whichever way you want to do it, we can do it with a huge selection of in stock and ready to go, most importantly, especially with what's going on right now. But we've got a lot of home theater and motion furniture and sectionals that we can put in the house right away. Hey, you're going to make us not want to leave which could be a good thing if some people are getting sick of others in their house. Just, hey, go, go to the football viewing room. <laughs> Sounds great. Jennifer, uh, let's move on to you now. You have some wonderful events happening. Uh, give us the details. Sure. So it's almost November and with November comes National Adoption Month. Mm -hmm. It's a time with when friends like Ron and Pete, we are able to celebrate and raise awareness of the amazing and beautiful kids who are in foster care right now waiting to be adopted. Yeah. You know, this is so important, especially now that these children not be forgotten. Their needs are great. They have been having a really difficult time like all of us. Mm -hmm. uh, so this this is the time that we focus on them and letting people know that they're waiting for family. They're waiting for a home. We are especially this year focused on older youth who um, are going to age out if they yeah. aren't able to connect with a, a family. So we want to make sure that hap that doesn't happen. This year, we usually at this time of year would be getting ready for our State House event where we'd welcome hundreds of people to the State House to unveil the Heart Gallery. But this year, like so many so many other ways things have changed. We have a robust social media calendar filled with events and activities mm -hmm. to meet these children, to get to know them, to learn more how to help. And we hope our viewers will, will take a look and join us. I'll never forget that day years ago where I was able to watch an adoption become official with you guys. And it was such a wonderful moment. And we hope for more of that in the future. So I like that you made things go virtual. We love that. And Pete, you have supported Adoption Rhode Island for so many years. Adoption Rhode Island and Cardi's have this connection. They really go hand in hand. Yeah, uh, Ron and I and everyone here has been happy to support Adoption Rhode Island. They do fabulous work, as you mentioned. Adoption Day is so cool. Have 20, 22, 24 kids with everyone in the courthouse, a fun, fun time. Mm -hmm. uh, but those adoptions still can take place, maybe not with the uh, frivolity of a party, but it's so important the work they do, and we hope everyone joins in. And if you know of someone that can uh, is in the opportunity to adopt or get into the foster care program, Adoption Rhode Island, they are the gold standard for what needs to happen and it's a great process it's an easy process just go to their website and check it out you hit on a great point pete as well it's it's adoption and foster care as well mm -hmm. there's a need for yes. both so we hope that yes. a lot of people come out and this is a good reminder that there are folks in need of a loving home out there so thank you all so much for joining us thank you thank you we got to find those forever families for the kids out there. If you'd like more details and more Road Home segments, just head on over to Roadshow.com and click on the Road Home channel.